So far, so good. We'll see. Ugh. Just bumping it up before the game starts. Here we go. So yeah, is this, uh, is this a winner's... Okay, no, it's a winner's semis of Justin JPEG versus Infernape fighting for the rights to get into winner's finals here. Justin JPEG rocking the Rob right now. Infernape rocking the Diddy Kong. A lot of Diddy Kongs tonight. Yeah, you got uh, Infernape, EJJ, Petmonk. Trapsef. Trapsef, good gravy. When did that happen? I don't know. I felt bad because I, I was, uh, someone was playing Trap Seth next and they're like, who does Trap Seth play? I'm like, oh, he's a Falco player. And then I look over in the game one, he's playing Diddy Kong. I'm like, what? <laughs> was I wrong? No, <laughs> Did no, I he, dream it all? He co-mains them, but uh, matchup dependent, I guess. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like lately these Xenos have been themed. Like uh, a couple weeks ago, or like two weeks ago, it was like all Bowsers. There was like five Bowsers here. Now we have like four Diddy Kongs. Mm -hmm. The time before that, who knows? Who knows? We had, I think we had like three Lucinas today too. So. Oh yeah. People sticking with the characters they love. Here we go. Pretty good neutral coming out so far. Justin JPEG getting the upper hand with this Rob. Ooh. Yeah, both of these players gonna be looking at to get their item play started. Yeah. You can see Justin looking for a like a Z drop combo with the banana instead of the gyro. Yeah, what's the difference? You know, if you know how to do it with one, I guess you'd apply it to the other. Down tilt up smash, not enough to take the stock, but this might, ooh, didn't drift enough yep, to land that's a, the up smash. That's a heavy robot, monkey flip, clawing the eyes out, not gonna be taking it just ooh. yet. Laser Justin finding himself some room here on this ledge trap. Has to contend with the banana, but just taking the high road. Just why even bother with the ledge? Yeah, for if real. If you don't wanna get ledge trapped. Ooh, peanut coming out. Oh, this is like, this is a neutral. The gyros are coming out, the peanuts are coming out. The banana, not coming out yet, but I'm sure it will be in a second. Actually, I think he's afraid to throw it because oh he's God. gonna get hit by gyro if he does. Yeah, I actually uh, like Ooh. Infernape's restraint right now, not pulling out the banana, not wanting to give Justin any sort of space in this neutral. You could see he was playing a very great keep away game because he knew that the grab was online for Justin JPEG. Yeah, good job catching that air dodge in there by Infernape too, you know, throwing out the up smash and it lands and we're back at it. Well, it's been a very, uh-oh. Oh, I thought he was getting into some custom combo territory mm -hmm. there, but finding nothing after the, the down air. Great call out, by the way, on the jump from disadvantage by Infernape into great, yeah. some great damage off of that uh, jetpack. I agree. Barrels are hype. I love watching a Diddy Kong use barrels in a creative way. Oh, oh what was that? Oh, oh my god. god. After such a great start oh to the second stock god. by Infernape, got hit in between the two parts of his getup attack, was not invincible anymore, and found a down tilt for his troubles. Justin JPEG now in a pretty commanding lead against Infernape. Yeah, that was crazy. There's, there's no, That was crazy. But now, you know, yeah, Rob's pretty heavy. You know, it's definitely going to be Justin JPEG favored. Uh, Infernape has a lot more work to do to find the stock, I think. Yeah, especially without Rage on the board. He's going to need to find something yeah. crazy. Forward smash from center stage, not going to be doing too much. Yeah, and Justin uh, doing a good job of racking up that extra credit from long range. You know, you don't you don't have to be next to him to do damage as Rob, so just just wait it out. Ooh, down tilt, gyro, nothing coming out of it. Uh oh, Justin now gets to have both items at his disposal. <laughs> That'll oh do it. Oh my god, that was so much oh! charge on the up smash. Not enough to take it though. Great DI from Infernape, who is ready to get hit by his own banana, I guess. That up smash was slow cooked to perfection. Mm. Well, okay, maybe a little bit underdone because Infernape's still alive. Yeah, now it's Infernape's turn, picking the gyro up, but letting it go. Oh, oh that'll do it. Lord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back air right to the face. Right to the face. Justin JPEG taking game one with a two stock. See Infernape definitely having some trouble taking stocks in this game one. We can see 173 on the first stock. Uh, Justin JPEG was living to 180 on the second stock. Yeah, and this the stock after this one that was that was crazy. I'm excited to watch it back. The last one that JPEG. This one, this one, this upcoming one. Like in front, yeah, yeah, just yeah. did a ton. This was down, nasty. He gets down, down tilted in between the getup attack. That is unlucky. And then catching him with Rob neutral. 
Hey, you know a thing or two about this character. I, I have played a little bit of Greninja in my time. I'm still an O2-er, but you know, I, yeah. have I have played a little bit of Greninja. So we're going to be seeing Infernape right now opting to try to control this long-range space with the uh, uncharged Ooh. water shurikens, trying to dissuade Justin getting the gyro online. But right now, not quite working out. Yeah, All right. some unlucky trades to start for uh, Infernape, but now doing a good job of pushing it, finding nothing off the neutral air, but catches the air dodge in with the dash attack. Yeah, was maybe looking for a uh, raw back air there was Infernape, but instead Justin JPEG is going to be having his feet on solid ground here. Yeah, it's tried to parry Rob's neutral be there, but Ooh. missed, and whoa, the shadow sneak coming out. Oh. Tries to grab the... Oh, my god! He actually tried to substitute the gyro, but unfortunately oh. just didn't come out in time. You could even see the little spark. Whoa. That All grab right. going deep. Yeah, oh, good I, I mean, <laughs> with the, like, double-digit frame data that it takes for Greninja's grab to come out, it, it better well have yeah. a range <laughs> like that. I'm actually surprised. You very rarely see Greninja's uh, shield grab anything. Oh, looks for the Ooh, shadow the sneak again, but fool me once. Can't get fooled again. Yeah, instead just right into Justin JPEG's loving arms with that tombstone taking stock one. See, neutral air forward air not going to be taking it that just That might do yet. it, yeah. Oh my god. Catches him way at the top. A good up air from Infernape, and he's right back in this. Yeah, I mean, some great, like, anti-Rob specific tech. Rob is one of those characters who can very uniquely go that high on the recovery. And when you've got, like, a double jump as great as Greninja's, just drag him all the way to the heavens with uh, with the up air. Yeah, for real. That thing's, just, like, right up there with Falco, so why not get up? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. He's gotten hit by that twice where it's just, like, this long-range neutral V that you probably should be. Uh oh oh just barely fell out of that Aegis Reflector setup in Fernape, getting to live his second what is he stop doing? just a little bit. I think Justin wants to land in Up Smash. Yeah. Uh, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Coming down there. Oh, was looking for an option there from Infernape, but Infernape picks the right one, just landing it out with shield. Oh. The Up Smash act, or like Justin running in for the Up Smash actually pushed the, pushed the gyro out just enough to cover Infernape's drift away, putting him in a terrible spot, and now putting him in a terrible spot in this game too, as he is now only one stock to Justin's two. Yeah, and a lot of ground to make up here for Infernape, but, uh, and Justin has been playing pretty soundly, so, I don't know, this is gonna be a tough one for sure. Justin doing a good job playing around these shurikens, dash attack forward air coming out, but tries to catch him up high again, nothing coming out, ends up getting up aired himself, Infernape, so, Justin doing a good job of pushing this lead. All right, Inferno trying to make some space for himself, just Ooh. trying to get away from this scary robot. Great patience, though, on the back air. Inferno getting to hold on, but getting put right back in a ledge trap situation. Lucky trade coming out there. <laughs> Finds the Nair into the up air, which would have... Nah, it wouldn't have killed. That'll kill, though. Ooh, yeah, missed tech. That's going to be a down smash, and that's going to be Justin JPEG taking things, taking winner's semis, like, pretty convincingly. Yeah, that was really, really good work from Justin JPEG, who uh, who caught a lot of um, of what Infernape was doing, and an unlucky SD there from Infernape, too, which sucks, because I really wanted to see how that played out with his uh, Greninja a little bit more. Yeah, let's see. So yeah, the gyro there gets pushed Ooh. by Justin JPEG. Just barely, Infernape just kind of stubs his toe on it. Yeah, that was silly. Tough. And then, you know, from here, no tech, you're getting, mm -hmm. you're getting, a, you're getting a down smash. You're yeah, down I mean, smash. even if he did tech, like, down smash pretty much covered every option there. Yeah, I mean, real. he would have had to tech in and still be put in a terrible situation by the down smash sending the other way. So yeah, just great awareness there by Justin JPEG. Just checkmate. Yeah, and he moves on. He, does he play John numbers now? Uh, he will play the winner of John versus.